anime in here? I did. What other man have you watched, watched Brandon? I watched a lot. I watched Naruto. I watched Dragon Ball Z. I don't know. It's repetitive. I watched Naruto 1. Uh, mm -hmm. Then I watched Shippuden. I've seen uh, Attack on Titan. I've seen Demon Slayer. I've seen Seven Deadly Sins. On what platform these on, bro? Uh, a bunch of different platforms. Bro, I've man. watched a bunch of anime. I've seen One Piece. I've seen... You see the great ones. Show. He likes and shows. You watch, you know what uh, yeah, my brother watches anime a lot. Uh, what my else? brother does too. Let's see. Uh, mm -hmm. Jujutsu Kaisen. Really, I can just keep going. I've seen a bunch of anime. Hey, 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 hey. I did not know so that. What's, what's your favorite part? Because <laughs> I don't watch anime. All time? Like, all, all time? time? Probably Naruto. Show. Yeah, that's everybody's yeah, favorite. Bro. Everybody likes Shippuden like, is golden. Like, Dragon Ball Z. Easy. I've heard a lot about Dragon Slayer. Dragon Ball Z is, is, is too uh, repetitive. It's the same shit over and over in different storylines. I did not know that was considered anime. I love anime. Dragon Ball Z, though. What? I, I, didn't know, know. I didn't know that was considered anime. Yeah, it's like a cartoon. That's crazy. Japanese. Oh, so that's what makes Japanese yeah. cartoons yeah. will make something an anime. Okay. Yeah, art style. Yeah, yeah. Art style. Boondocks, how it looks. Boondocks is considered anime. Yeah, man. Yeah, that, really? That's the yeah. anime I've seen. Yeah, oh, okay. That's, that's, that's what I saw called. Alrighty, man. Yeah, it's I, I it's do not watch anime at all. That's Ross. I've seen a bunch. Really? Goblin yeah. Slayer. I can what is it Demon called? The Slayer? Slayer? Demon Slayer. Yeah, Demon, Demon Slayer. Slayer. That's what I one had a movie. Yeah, my brother. I heard of Is it Hunter Hunter? Hunter I've seen that too. Oh, and My Hero Academia. That was pretty good. What about you, Todd? You watch any anime? Yeah. What anime you watch, brother? I think Hanoki. If I'm saying it right, it's like dude went to a ghost, got some like superpowers. Uh, Dragon Ball Z. You watched a lot of Dragon Ball Z. It's, it's like yeah. three, it's like oh, seven Dragon different Ball. versions. Dragon oh, Ball, Dragon, Dragon, Ball, Ball Z, Dragon Ball Z, GT, Dragon Ball Z, GT, Dragon Ball Z, Super, Kai, yeah. Super. I know like, the Dragon Ball Z games. games. You, you know that yeah, game? Yeah, the game used to be. You see, they just announced a new, a new yeah. Dragon Ball Z game, the the, the best one. I didn't even play. Who I didn't even take Aichi Four. I didn't even watch Dragon Ball Z, bro. <laughs> that and I love the Dragon Ball Z game. Yeah. Yeah. That's what it's called. Yeah. That's what it's called. I was messed up. That's what it's called. I said, what the fuck? I said, damn, everybody could have been a kill bill. You know the Japanese? All right, man. <laughs> Nah, that game is different. That game is go. I used to love getting it. When you scuff, you gotta press the buttons. Naruto is stupid hard for me, bro. The game's pretty good. I have so hard. Can't lie, man. I never got into anime. Let's see what he's talking about. This is my first. I like anime. Some of it's kind of crazy. Most disrespectful moments. Anime history. Anime history. Oh, we might have to take one out then. No, Kanye is very inspired by anime. Word. His favorite anime is called Kira. Like classic movie, the art style makes sense. Crazy, Word. it's hand drawn. Like look at these. Yeah. Yeah. I just see people get the anime yeah. added on them. Oh, people. Oh yeah, my mom always got an anime sleeve. Dang, that's crazy. crazy. What is the cartoon? Mango? Mango? Manga. Manga, that's what it's yeah. called, yeah. Manga. So, uh, I would say yeah. this is my first yeah, time. Comic book. Me too, man. Yeah. Really getting into anime and sitting here yeah. watching it. Wow. Is For Avatar considered minutes. anime? I watched uh, Avatar. Nah, it's kind of a cartoon. Avatar. Avatar. It's probably like on the edge of anime cartoonish. Okay, I'll watch Avatar. Yeah, Avatar, Avatar was good. Avatar, Avatar was good. Avatar was your favorite thing? Yeah, he was the Earth, Wind, and Fire. I always like I didn't get that deep. It was the best. They had a lot of Fire and Earth, if I could bend that one. That's why he's like, how you ride that? That thing, that big thing. Oh, the album. Album. Yeah, that was beautiful. He was a, a bison. <laughs> I feel like I was floating with him, bro. <laughs> yeah, All right, man. The shit. most different, disrespectful moments in anime history. Let's get it. Hey, this storm is funny, y'all. Uh, that ass was getting <laughs> Man literally picked up this big ass nigga with That's one hand body. and threw him across the floor and just locks him into the bag. So Baki's like, all right, bro, enough is enough, is enough, enough, nigga. So he comes running in just to get that signature back. Oh, literally spams his whole body out. Damn. <laughs> that was on Netflix. It was pretty good. Man, it's like two different shows. Ooh, wait. Ooh, wait. That was the class, but That's the type of time right there. Oh, all the good stuff. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, it is finally time for the most disrespectful moments in anime history too. Now you see, this one is gonna be a little different. So usually we would have multiple characters from multiple animes in the video. But today, we're gonna be focusing on one character. Now I know some of y'all are probably wondering, CJ, why are you only focusing on one character in this video? Well, uh, how do I put this? The man that we are about to talk about might damn well be the most disrespectful man in anime history. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, Yujiro Hanma is a mobile black hero. Like, dog, this nigga's on demon timing 24 7. From slapping bitches to beating the fuck out of his own son. Nigga out here fighting a polar bear for fun. This man's nickname is the strongest creature on earth. Peep how they said creature instead of human. 
this nigga! This Dang. man got 0.01% body fat. A jawline gifted from Jesus himself. <laughs> is a literal second torso. You got a six pack on your back, nigga! I understand why they call him creature now. Like, if you get compared to Bigfoot's fat ass, you, you, you's literally just, I don't know, nigga, you just built different. Oh, mm -hmm. freaky ass shit. Oh, but I can hear some of y'all already typing in the comment section right now. Hey, hey, yo, CJ! Why that nigga not at the round table yet, cuz? <laughs> listen, 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 listen. I know Yujiro has been the most requested person to be in the round table of Black Air Force activity, besides, like, guns. Well, you wanna know why it took me so long to do this? Because, you see... This man has done so much heinous ass shit that I cannot give him a regular trial. Like dead ass hours for not even So I was like, all right, bro. I'm just gonna have to give him a whole most disrespectful moments in anime history episode to himself. Cause this is the only way I could do it because it's gonna be a lot, bro. Like I'm probably not even gonna be able to add everything on here. So anything I leave off, just tell me and I'ma just put them in other parts. So everybody sit back, relax, grab some popcorn, lace up your black ones and uh, Let's get started. My popcorn. So to understand the philosophy of Yujiro Hama's God, I mean, cool. ways, we have to go all the way back. So far back, the main character ain't even born yet. We're talking about 1973 in the Vietnam War. This man was fighting in a whole ass war with his bare hands at the age of 16. God, Nigga, please. this is like the equivalent of running around in war zone with your bare fists and just beating the shit out of everybody. Like this motherfucker took guerrilla warfare to a whole nother level on some pure ass Rambo type shit. Why is in Vietnam? He meets what? a girl named Jane. And she out here trying to throw that ass back. She trying to scare <laughs> the hell out of this man. She like, you wanna get laid, nigga? Oh, you scared? Or maybe you still haven't experienced a woman yet. And look at this man, he like, uh, bitch, shut the fuck up. <laughs> he just turns around and walks away, bruh. Man, it's like, I'm not about this bullshit today. But she still keep on running her mouth and talking shit. So the moment she turned around, this man Yujiro came right behind her back and said, Should I tear your skull out right here? Homie was dead ass about to peel the skin off of this bitch. Like, look at her, she like, Damn, this nigga got two fingers in my mouth. Then this man just kick slaps her like 20 yards, gave her a whole leg, she then walked out into the sunset. <laughs> but I never thought this man was done in Vietnam. Nah, he was just getting started. This man goes on to kill a whole ass general on some covert ops type shit. And to disguise himself so he could enter the base, he ripped off the general's face and used it as a mask. <laughs> Killing every single person hey, in this path, busting through ceilings and shit. Look at the bus back up and she's like, listen, nigga, I got some TNT and I'm about to blow this bitch sky high. So while they're escaping, Yujiro stops. She's like, what the fuck, nigga, why you stop? And he just stands there and just eats the entire explosion. Then he picks up that soul girl again. And he figures out that she's a whole ass UN agent named Diane that's leading him into a whole trap. So she tried to kill him, but obviously, uh, that ain't gonna work, honey. So how did he make her pay for this? Well, he gave her that redo of the healer treatment. So after he gives her the googlies, this man uses her as a body shield, then just kills everybody outside and breaks this nigga's neck with one hand. So all girl holds this man up at gunpoint, trying to kill him again. Then this man flashed the whole demon back at her and just look at her face, bruh. Just in pure shock. She like, damn. I'm really about to have that nigga's kid. And ladies and gentlemen, that is how Jack Honda was born. Oh, but guess what? That was just the first one. Shit, we gotta go over how the main character was born. <clears throat> Meet Emmy, Baki's crazy ass, weird ass mom. Like, for all I ain't gonna this bitch is weird as hell. But ladies and gentlemen, she always wasn't a crazy ass bitch. No, no, you see, back in the day, she was in a very happy relationship with a rich nigga. She was enjoying her life on a honeymoon. So then that night, they go to a party, right? And guess who's there? Yujiro, staring her ass down while she with her mans at a party and look at her bro she is mesmerized it's like he's dicking her down with just his eyes <laughs> and then the other nigga sees her just what straight up staring at him and then he just oh, stops her ass god damn in front of the party nigga so then this man confronts Yujiro and he's talking mad shit and he's like your fashion sense ass your cut ass your shoes ass your demeanor ass then he just throws a whole bunch of shit on my nigga so Yujiro's like oh you wanna get disrespectful alright I can get real disrespectful real quick so he just leans in and kisses Oh. So homie gets mad and he's like, all right, bro, I'm gonna let this dude handle you. But we all know this nigga ain't gonna do shit. So Yujiro just gets from the nasty ass kicking, just 
Yeah. That's so disrespectful. Just completely one shot. Oh Embarrassing <laughs> old dude even more and giving his wife the old giddy giddy. So then this man goes back to his hotel all mad and shit because he got made to look like a whole ass beta male in front of his wife. <laughs> He's trying to take out his anger on his wife and shit. But this man Yujiro pulls up in the hotel room just out of nowhere. Man is like, hey girl, I came to see you. In homeboy's room. <laughs> but then dude runs over to the phone on scared and shit like, hey yo security, where the fuck y'all niggas at? Somebody come help me. <laughs> <laughs> security. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. This nigga's knocked the fuck out. The old dude pulls a gun on him, but we all know what happens when you try to pull a gun on this nigga. He grabs him with one hand and breaks his neck while still flirting at the same time. And look at her, she liked that. Oh, she <laughs> freak. So then he like, listen, girl, let me give you the sweet talk real quick. I want to break your back so goddamn hard. <laughs> Shit, I might even break your back so goddamn hard it might even kill you one day. Give birth to my child so I can have a worthy opponent in the future. And yeah, uh, said, that's how down. Baki was born. So when Yujiro first makes his first appearance in the anime, this man is jumping out of a whole ass helicopter and <laughs> passes himself no, into a room, shoot. not giving a fuck about property damage at all. So he comes in with Baki was fighting Hanayama. And look at that bro with a whole smile on his face. He's like, what's good, nigga? Homie dead ass said, good. I made it in time. Looks like you just got started. Y'all niggas only got scratches right now. And the fight is already over. But this man Yujiro's like, nigga, if I I don't see blood, the shit didn't even start. <laughs> <laughs> he just like that. And he's just laughing his ass off. So then Hanayama's like, all right, bro, I'll fight you. But my, my nigga, you shouldn't have said that shit. Cause boy, that ass was good. <laughs> Man literally picked up this big ass nigga with one hand and threw him across the floor and just knocks him into the wall. Oh. Baki's like, all right, bro, enough is enough, nigga. So he comes running in just to get that signature back. Literally spazzed his whole body out. So before he leaves, he picks up Hanayama and he's like, let me get him one last lick. Then he punches his whole face and finish the job that he already finished. Then he's like, this was a waste of time. Y'all niggas are sorry, I'm leaving. <laughs> Damn. This man is actually built different. So then we go see Emmy's crazy ass. <laughs> she just starts trying to beat him, but he ain't even moving, bro. <laughs> then he just pushes her down, and he's like, bitch, I told you to raise my son to be strong as hell. That nigga weak as fuck. So then she trying to shake him, but he was like, cut that shit out. Yo, this man is... <laughs> oh, like, he must have blasted her brains out of something. So after all that goes down, Baki's like, all right, bro, I gotta fight my dad at this point. So the night before the fight, Emmy's like, shit, let me go see what that nigga Ujiro doing real quick. So she's watching this man train in the hotel room, right? So she's like, mm, let me touch up on that nigga. Then he just grabs her whole face and just pushes her back. Look at this nigga. He's like, bitch, the fuck? Don't approach me until I tell you to approach me. You better hope to God Baki can fight me tomorrow or else your ass is grass to me. So she's like, I'll stay tonight. And he said, nah, bitch, get the fuck out. Kajira <laughs> has absolutely broken her mind at this point. This shit just starts beating up on Baki like, why won't he love me? Oh my God. I told y'all this bitch was weird. Y'all here beating up her own son because her husband won't love her. Shit. My boy Baki got she the most still fucked up family I've ever seen. Shit, I don't know who's more dysfunctional at this point. The Hanmas, the Mishimas, or the Skywalkers. So then Baki and Kajira finally fight, but... Dear God, bro, this was the worst ass whooping I've probably ever seen. This <laughs> man was literally eating every single punch he threw at him. Not even moving a muscle. <laughs> <laughs> literally complimenting everybody for thank you for raising him like this guys y'all actually made him kind of strong so then this nigga's like all right bro it's time to eat so he just like well no. knocked him out and started beating his Damn. face into the ground over and over and over Damn. constantly just beating the hell that's his son watching this yeah. like Damn, I'm gonna do that. Son the whole so then the mom's like, all right, I've been Watch. being weirdest the whole this time. This nigga beat the fuck out of my son. So then she started trying to swing on Yujiro, but dear God, baby girl. So she started biting him and shit. So then Yujiro gets her a whole bear hug and he's like, remember when I told you that one day I might break your back so goddamn hard it might even kill you? Today's the day, bitch. Oh! man literally killed his wife and beat the hell out of his son in one night. And after that, he's like, y'all niggas want to have fun too? He just starts beating the hell out of him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he, he's he's killed killed wife, you know, just yeah. goes around just doing his daily life, doing his daily activities, just he's got like bro. <laughs> Homie went up into a boxing gym, started throwing shit around, literally slapping this man's punches away. <laughs> Throws his ass down and just beats everybody up at the gym. Busted up into the prime minister's office. Literally beat the brakes off of his entire security force. 
while he was doing this, he took a break and smoked a cigarette. He was looking at the everything he couldn't do. Nigga just hit the dash. Breaks both of them. Busts into his office and he's like, hey, nigga, your security is ass. And also, fuck your ass. Then we go into the next arc and my guy Baki's like, bro, I gotta get revenge for this dude killing my mom. So when Yujiro's confront Jack, he's like, hey, nigga, you kinda strong. Now fight me, nigga. But then Baki comes in and he intervenes. So then Yujiro's like, nigga, if you don't get the fuck up on <laughs> Reveals his 1% body fat demon bag, beats the living piss out of him, also taking the nigga's eye and knocked him out standing up. So after all that goes up, knocked him out standing up. What happened? Fight Muhammad Ali and shows him freaking his son across the planet. Like, he's sitting there looking like a Then he busts up in Baki's house and he's like, hey, nigga, I see you about to do it with your girl and shit, okay? And when you first see this and you're like, oh my god, this is the never watched the anime before. This man is literally standing over them while him and his girl are about to get it on. And he is dead ass encouraging them to do this shit. He's like, yes, Baki, blow her back out. Blow her back out like I did your mother. It'll make you stronger than ever. And I'm just watching that shit like, did this nigga just really encourage his son to beat the fuck out of her cheeks? Because it'll make him stronger? What in the hell? Then Baki's like, bruh, why are you in here, nigga? And yo, this man dead ass says this. You're pretty funny, you know that, kid? A girl sneaks into your room, comes on to you, and you tremble with fear. If that's your idea of closing the deal, I'll never be a granddad. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So then this man's like, I give you my blessing, then just leaves. So then we come to this fight with Multiba and Yami. Now, Multiba has won the fight. He cut off old poison dude's hand and's like, hey, nigga, that's a rap. Concede. Nigga, you lost. So then just out of the blue, this nigga Yujiro just comes out of nowhere. He's like, hey, hey this nigga's cracking. So this man pulls his sword on him like he gonna do something. But then this man Yujiro does the most demoralizing thing I've ever seen in an anime. He started laughing, grabbed his sword, and started breaking it into pieces <laughs> one by one slowly. Look at this nigga's face. This is just the face of a uh, nigga, I'm fucked. <laughs> that just drains all of your confidence. That is like the biggest you so ain't shit thing really that enjoy. you can ever do to somebody. Back. And then this man Yujiro pulls up on Yanagi and he's like, hey nigga. You lost. So then she <laughs> he's like, hey, bro, what the fuck are y'all doing out here? It's late as hell. Then Yujiro's like, shit, nigga, you right. I'm tired. I'm going home. But not at the <laughs> <laughs> Get your stupid ass. <laughs> just blasted his face. Homie knocked the fuck out and just tooted up. Nigga, dead ass. <laughs> so that meant you were up for the child. Man literally had to get in one lick before he left. So then we get to the right time tournament. <sighs> and Lord have mercy. Ooh, I'm going to have to censor this part so hard. This man ripped off. This nigga's face. Oh. He literally dug his fingers into his fucking face and flung that shit and just started yeah. busting his face. Then he threw his face into the car. Oh my god, that's fucking disgusting. But after that, homie comes for round two, but nigga, why did you come for round two against this nigga? And then you were just blasting his face. Finally, to I guess finish oh, the job. I mean, the job was already finished. Hey, shit. I'm trying to figure out who cares. Like, Dad, I think I can take you now. <laughs> this man, on, Yujiro, was looking at him like, really, nigga? Just throws him through the wall. This man was like, you ain't shit and you still ain't shit. <laughs> so then he fights the old Where's OG the for the last fight. And I ain't gonna lie, old OG was landing some punches. Mm. But this nigga, Yujiro, did not care that he was beating the fuck out of a senior citizen. Because goddamn, he was whooping that ass. <laughs> I didn't even know that the senior citizen dropped him. Oh, Homie put out that demon yeah. back, and there you got it. It was a break. Oh, the motherfucker oh, kicked the bucket in the middle of the fight. Somehow that man came back to life. I don't know if they got the Dragon Balls or some shit. <laughs> That's my lucky ass OG. I'll tell you that. Well, uh, I guess all the evidence. This man looks like, is that Giannis? Like, it looks like Giannis. Oh, oh, like Giannis. finally into the round table of Black Air Force. They look like, a like I think it might be safe to say that this man might be the most disrespectful man in anime. Yeah, this to beat I mean, he doesn't care if you made a woman, oh, child, child or senior anime. citizen. He beating the shit out of your ass. His hands are dead ass ready to eat for everyone. So, yeah. <laughs> so like round table of Black Air Force activity. Uh, yo, this video is Black Force took forever to round table. Yeah, uh, that's the most activity. disrespectful moment in the history to the Yujiro Hanma special. <laughs> this man is a certified walking Yujiro. Black Air Force. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's it. Yeah, I'm out this hoe. Man, this guy put together a great video, yeah, bro. Yeah, 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 great great video, bro. Wow, bro. This is this guy, man. This guy's storytelling is entertaining. He's great. CJ, what is that? I don't even.
can say that. Jay. The champ. The champ. The champ. The champ. I'm talking about. This guy's a great storyteller in his edits yeah, and all that. that you did your thing, man. That was great. Yeah, that was amazing. amazing. He like summarized the whole like two like three shows into one. Beautiful yeah. narration. Yeah. And he made it so simple for somebody who don't know nothing about yeah. anime. I yeah. learned so much. His, yeah. his commentary funny. I fooled you, CJ. So yeah. What you know about anime? Can anybody whoop this guy? Yeah, Baki like, and anybody whoop dude. So like the tournament, I'm pretty sure he like set the tournament up to see if anybody's strong enough to like see him with the hands. That's why he was in there just whooping everybody because they wasn't they wasn't they wasn't seeing him. So nobody I used to mix the animes off. together to my little brother because when I see somebody scrapping so hard, I'm like, can Goku beat him? He said, bro, you can't do that. <laughs> So I was like, hey, mm, I don't want to mix it, but can Goku do something with this? Oh, yeah, for I sure. I think so. Yeah, Goku. Goku, Goku bro, you got to realize, Goku, Goku, get a nigga Goku had been zipped <laughs> multiple times. Yeah. He been, he done got zipped and killed and revived. Yeah. And came back and got killed it's again. Different. I ain't going to lie. Nobody killed dude. Yeah, nobody, <laughs> nobody seeing dude. They got Goku. It wasn't even like, but Goku got dropped one time. time. But Goku can erupt the whole planet. Bro. He's bro, killing the gods. Goku, seeing him. Goku, he Goku, me, Goku, Goku has been zipped multiple times. Times, yeah, but man, yeah, those, really, those some really regular, sweet. regular ass motherfuckers fighting him. Nah, bro, you watch the show. So they got some, some of the people that he fight. They got like special abilities. Like, mm. what's the show called? It's called Baki. It's on Netflix. Okay, it's like yeah, two we, different ones. Go check that out, Baki. Yeah, this is my first time watching anime ever in my life. You know, dope. this is beautiful, man. That uh, blew so, well, my black brain. We might get into some anime on this channel, guys. So Not let us know anime. if y'all wanted to let us know some great shows. Uh, what did you, what, what you say? What did you say? What did you say? Oh, he said it blew his brains. I said he didn't have many of them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, man. Y'all let us know y'all favorite anime shows and let us know uh, more videos about this guy, man. We're out of here. Hit on Instagram.